Hi guys, welcome to Cup of Teach. This time I'm going to discuss problems involving proportions. Problem number one, the measures of the three angles of a triangle are in the ratio 3 is to 4 is to 5. Find the measure of each angle. Let 3x, 4x, and 5x represent the measures of the three angles. We're going to add the three angles and equate this to 180. Kasi, the sum of the three angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. Then, simplify natin yung 3x plus 4x plus 5x, that is equal to 12x. Then, you just copy 180. Divide both sides by 12, kasi ang kailangan natin ma-solve yung x. So, cancel out ang 12, sa left side matitira ay x. Then, divide natin ang 180 and 12. So, x is equal to 15. So, since meron na tayong value ng x, pwede na nating isolve ang measures ng 3 angles. By substitution, we will have now 3 times 15, because that is the value of x, equals 45 degrees. 4 times 15 equals 60 degrees. 5 times 15 equals 75 degrees. So, para ma-check natin kung tama yung sagot nyo, ang sum nitong tatlo na to ay 180 degrees. Problem number 2, the measures of the two complementary angles are in the ratio 7 is to 8. Find the measures. Let 7x and 8x represent measures of the two complementary angles. Let us get the sum, 7x plus 8x. Equate this to 90. Kasi ang pinag-uusapan na natin dito ay complementary angles. The sum of the two angles is 90 degrees. So that is why we have to equate this to 90. Then simplify 7x plus 8x equals 15x. Just copy 90. Divide both sides by 15 to solve for x. So sa left side matitira na lang ay x. Then, 90 divided by 15, the answer is 6. Therefore, x is equal to 6. So, pwede na natin isolve ang angles. So, the measures of the two angles are 7x and 8x. Substitution, ang x natin ay 6 na. So, that is 7 times 6 equals 42 degrees. 8 times 6, that is 48 degrees. So, para ma-check natin, pwede nating i-add ang 42 and 48, dapat siya ay equal to 90 degrees. Number 3, the perimeter of a triangle is 90 centimeters and the lengths of its sides are in the ratio 6 is to 8 is to 4. Find the length of the shortest side. Let 6x, 8x, and 4x represent sides of a triangle. 6x plus 8x plus 4x is equal to 90. Kasi that is the perimeter of the triangle. Then simplify natin 6x plus 8x plus 4x. That is equal to 18x. Just copy 90. Then divide both sides by 18 to solve for x. Cancel out 18. Therefore, x is equal to 5. So, since meron na tayong x, pwede na natin kuhanin ang measures ng sides ng triangle. So, let's have here 6x, 8x, and 4x. Substitution, we will have now 6 times 5. Kasi x ay 5. That is equal to 30 centimeters. 8 times 5 equals 40 centimeters. 4 times 5. That is equal to 20 centimeters. So, wag kakalimutan yung units. Then, ang tanong dito sa problem is shortest side. So, ang shortest side natin ay 20 centimeters. Number 4, the ratio of the measures of the supplementary angles is 4 is to 5. Find the angle measures. Let 4x and 5x represent the measures of the supplementary angles. Let us add the two angles, 4x plus 5x. We have to equate this to 180 degrees kasi 
ang pinag-uusapan na natin dito ay supplementary angles. Kapag sinabi nating supplementary angles, the sum of the two angles is 180 degrees. So that is why we have to equate this to 180. Add the 2, 4x plus 5x, that is equal to 9x. Just copy 180. To solve for x, we need to divide both side by 9. Cancel out 9. Sa left side natin, matitira na lang ay x. Then 180 divided by 9, the answer is 20. So this is now the value of x. So since meron na tayong value ng x, we can solve now the measures of the two angles, 4x and 5x. Substitution, since ang x natin ay 20, so palit na natin siya sa x. We will have now 4 times 20 equals 80 degrees. 5 times 20 equals 100 degrees. So, huwag kalilimutan yung degrees natin. To check whether your answer is correct, add natin yung 80 and 100, it should be 180 degrees. Number 5, the rope is cut into 3 parts. In the ratio, 2 is to 5 is to 9. If the rope is 128 meters long, find the length of each part. Let 2x, 5x, and 9x represent the lengths of the three parts. Let us add yung tatlong parts ng rope. 2x plus 5x plus 9x. Then equate to 128. Kasi yaan yung pinaka haba ng rope. Add yung 2x, 5x, and 9x. That is equal to 16x. You just copy 128. To solve for x, we need to divide both side by 16. Cancel out 16. Sa left side natin, matitira ay x. Then 128 divided by 16, that is equal to 8. Therefore, ang value na ng x natin ay 8. Since meron na tayong value ng x, we can solve now for the measures of the three parts. Substitution, we will have now 2 times 8 because that is the value of x equals 16 meters. 5 times 8 equals 40 meters. 9 times 8, that is equal to 72 meters. So, wag kalilimutan yung ating units na meters. Then, para ma-check natin kung tama yung sagot nyo, i-add natin ang tatlong measures, 16, 40, and 72. It should be 128 meters. Thank you for watching. That's it for this video. If you learned something here, don't forget to like and subscribe to Cup of Teach. See you on the next lesson. Bye!